Hi, my name is Magna Nodal and I am an airline captain. Today I have a very interesting case for you. On the 21st of May 2021, an Embraer EIJ-135 operating Khmer Flight 206 from Douala to Yaounda, the capital of Cameroon, landed on runway 19er at Yaounda Airport, but veered off the runway and stopped on soft ground. All 31 passengers and four crew escaped without injury, and the aircraft received little or no damage. The weather report 15 minutes prior to the incident indicated that there were light winds, moderate visibility, and light thunderstorm with rain. 45 minutes later, the rain was moderate and the winds were still very light. After the incident, the company released the following statement. Quote, Cameroon Airlines Corporation, Kamer Ku, announces that after landing at Yaounda Simalen International Airport, one of its aircraft, Embraer EIJ-135, Flight 206, from Douala, experienced a runway excursion following very bad weather conditions on Friday 21st, May 2021. No bodily or material damage was recorded. All passengers were disembarked normally. Comer Coup acknowledges the professionalism and dexterity, which means skill, of the entire crew who were able to control the aircraft in these very bad weather conditions. End quote. So, they blame the weather for the incident and hail the crew as professionals being able to control the aircraft? If the weather was as reported, it should have not been a factor at all. But tropical thunderstorms can create intense downpours in very short time, and that creates vicious wind that can make it dangerous to land. But passenger aircraft have weather radar, and if the radar detects dangerous weather, you don't land. So their manager or CAM Air as a pilot, I appreciate that you support your crew. This is very good because there are companies around the world who would fire the pilots for less. But blaming the weather for the incident and then appraising the crew for being professionals and able to control the aircraft doesn't make sense. If the weather was that bad, a professional pilot would not have landed. And if the crew did control the aircraft, they will not have ended outside the runway. An incident or accident doesn't happen because of a single factor, but a chain of events that finally leads to the outcome. Therefore, before you draw any conclusions, you must let the investigation team do the job and analyze every factor that could lead to this incident. Okay, that's all for this time. When more facts emerge, I will let you know. Thank you for watching. Have a wonderful day and happy learning.